Alrighty, we are here at the apartment. We're about to do a Costco trip. It's like not even nine in the morning. We're trying to get there before Costco even opens so we can actually have some decent parking. But I'm gonna do a little overview of what the apartment is looking like because I completely gutted it before I left. So I'm gonna do a little wrap around and then we're gonna head to Costco because we haven't put anything in the apartment yet or changed anything. So I'm gonna show you the before real quick. So in the cabinets, I really only have like minimal things on the end here. Like I just have some random stuff. But in terms of like all the other cabinets, like I cleared them out. So I can kind of fresh start with everything. The living room, I'm changing this rug over because this one just looks tattered as hell. And then look at what our apartment complex put in here. They put in a fat TV. We used to have like, it was like a pretty big TV, but this one is like massive. So that's kind of clutch. And then the only other thing is this picture frame fell, which honestly I'm really happy it fell because the poster inside is like uneven with the top. So I can actually fix that now without having to take it down. And then bathroom still has like a little bit of stuff. I put a lot of stuff in here that was like in the kitchen. And then what else? My room is kind of like a disaster right now because all of this is like kitchen stuff and living room stuff, literally insane. So we're gonna have to piece all that together. But yeah, we're about to head to Costco and we'll update when we're there and all the goodies we get. We've been doing pretty good. We're almost entirely done. We're searching for cat litter. Ironically, we can't find cat litter. I know, we're having a hard time finding cleaning products too. Target haul coming after this because most of the stuff we wanted, ironically, well, not most of it, well, most of it but like there. a lot, of, a good bit, like half of my list. A little under half of my list is going to be at Target instead, so uh, feeling very patriotic. Mm -hmm. Well, we got it at Costco. My car is ridiculously oh. full now, and Costco got insanely busy, insanely quick. Like, it's ridiculous right now. We came in right at opening and waited no, before it even opened. Waited before it even opened, and it's crazy right now. But yeah, we got Costco trip done. We're about to head to Target, so... I want to quit. No. When we were when we were taking these freaking roller carts up, I was losing it because I had this rug in the roller cart, like standing up, and it was taking the balance of the cart like off kilter. And I just at the very end, I literally dropped it in the middle of the hallway because I was like, I'm going to spaz out. Luckily, we have all of my stuff in. But we have all the things, it's just a matter of cleaning some things, organizing some things, and getting everything squared away. But we're about to take a much needed lunch break. I literally didn't even want to get, a, get up off the couch for lunch, but she's forcing me to. So we're going to go get some lunch and then come back and try to finish. I don't want to finish. I just told her I just want to give up. But <laughs> we're going to go get some lunch as an intermission for this situation so catch you on the flip side all right we just got back from lunch and i am deep in cleaning out my bathroom so i think i'm gonna put on a time lapse of me cleaning this and i'll get back to you when it's done so down the counters and just <laughs> cleaning the microwave. So we're trying to tag team it. I got these all clean and I've got some more space down there. And then under the sink, I've just got 
some basic bathroom stuff and I have so much toilet paper. I don't think I'll need to buy, buy toilet paper like literally all year. And that's not including all of this in here. So we are stuck. So I got all of the new stuff in and now we've got to get all the old stuff unpacked and all the stuff that's in my room and that's in my closet unpacked and some dishes rewashed all that good stuff so we'll see how it goes but yeah we're getting there slowly but surely i'm probably just gonna set up my phone on a time lapse while we squirrel around <laughs> and added some curtains so I'm just gonna go around and show all the little things. So to start out I added a little curtain just to hide all of this lovely behind here just to kind of hide that space. Then over here this was a game changer that I got was this little pot and pan organizer because it used to irritate me how much space all of that took up but that's really helping change the game here I have some new Tupperware got some new Tupperware because my old ones were just gross and then I went through and washed all of my glassware because it had been sitting in my closet for like four months and that's gross and then I just put some of my stuff we still got a bunch of room I need to get like a little foldable ladder so we can actually reach all of this like top space. And I also finally got bigger bowls because I swear last year, these were the only bowls I had and they're ridiculously small. Now my most favorite change is the rug. I thought the rug would look so good with the couch. And I think overall it just kind of makes the whole apartment look a little bit more homey. So yeah, that's the rug and it's nice and cushiony too, which is awesome. And then other thing I fixed was this picture frame, which fell, but got that all, all lined up. And then just the last thing that we added was another curtain, like the same one that's outside just to break up the space a little bit, but also there's a sensor on this light. And before putting this over, if you just like walked in this way, it would turn on. And also even if it does turn on, the curtain kind of breaks up the light, so it's really not that bad shining through. It looks brighter on camera, but I promise in person, like, it's really not bright at all. So yeah, that's kind of where the apartment's at, but I'm about to get ready and we're gonna head to dinner. So yeah. So we got back a little while ago and we brought dessert with us. So we got a tiramisu and an oreo cake that we're about to kill she's refusing to be in the video because she's like i'm sad i'm sad i'm in the mood but i rationed up we're trying each other's dessert we really like couldn't decide so we just got both but we're about to have a fat moment and eat some eat some dessert and watch something on netflix and then we also rationed out our diet coke <laughs> We had one Diet Coke and we like literally rationed it out for the last drop. So we're about to have a fat time and then watch something. I left the um, to-go boxes out just in case we have any leftovers. Cause of course we're gonna have leftovers, but we're gonna watch a little something and chill. So yeah. All 
Alrighty, it is the next morning. It's like 9.30 and I'm walking to the new church that I'm trying out. So I'll give updates either when I'm there or after. So yeah. That service was amazing. It was just awesome to hear and just feel how God was working through that. So that was awesome. And I definitely think I found my church. So that's really cool. People were awesome too. They're so sweet and welcoming. So really excited. Alrighty, we just got back from brunch and we're packing up to head back home. But I'll be back here within the next like week and a half, two weeks, and we'll be ready to start the year. So thank y'all so much for watching and I'll see y'all next time. Bye.